Hey my legion, how y'all doing today? I'm back with another Japan Crate video. And for all my Japan Crate videos, because of how unique they are, there'll definitely be a webcam, so you can definitely see my immediate reaction when trying one of these. And I got this uh, from the January one, and this is the Asahi Calpus Gummy. And uh, Calpus Calpico is a popular drink in Japan. These uh, soft gummies are coated in sugar and filled with Capricus. Now, Calpis, I sound like I said Calpis, Calpis, C-A-L-P-I-S dot C-O-W-P-I-S-S, C-A-L-P-I-S jelly filling. Uh, they said this right here is, uh, it's a milk-based beverage widely loved in Japan and most other countries, Cal Calpis, sold on the name Calpico. And it's, uh, the name is based on two things. Cal from the word cal, calcium and P-I-S taken from the Sanskrit word, word uh, salpis, which is one of the five tastes described in Buddhism. Okay, Sounds like I'm saying something bad. But I'm not saying piss, piss. But it sounds like I'm saying piss. Okay, I originally I screwed up. When I did the unboxing, I thought this was a drink mix. Because I got two drink mixes, uh, the last Japan crate, I didn't get any drink, drink mixes this time, but this is a candy. You see that different, unique uh, lettering in all the Japan uh, Japanese on here? And then they got like an American thing from the. Uh, that from? from this was the Asian food grocer in uh, San Francisco, California. Man, I like it has a resealable package. I like the resealable packaging. Okay, let's open this up and give it a taste. Let's see what it smells like. These are huge. It smells really weird. Okay. These are very... These look like... Uh, oh, shit. These look like those uh, spiced gumdrops that my grandmother used to have. And they had the white ones, too. Let's give this a taste. Wow, these are really different. Great texture. The jelly, it doesn't have, has a very odd off flavor. Not like a incredibly sweet You kind of taste sugar and stuff. You don't taste, and it's really hard to pinpoint the flavor, but. It's some type of exotic fruit or something. Very interesting, very neat. Very unique. I just don't know how to describe it. It's very uh, unusual. I have to give the. Calpus uh, gummy, an 8 out of 10, a very perplexed 8 out of 10, very unique flavor, but I can't pinpoint it. It doesn't really have like a very broad flavor, very understated. It's just very unusual and weird, but not bad at all. I don't mind these at all. They're just hard to describe. An 8 out of 10 for, uh, the full name. I'm glad I have this thing that describes it because it's all in Japanese. Uh, eight, out, 8 out of 10 for the Asahi Kalpas Gummy. Pretty decent. I like it. From my Japanese, uh, from my Japan crate, from the January Japan crate. Wow, once again, thank you to my sister very much for uh, getting this for me for my birthday, actually, which was December 29th of last year. So, Thank you very much, Jody. 8 out of 10 for this candy. Until next time, bye, please. Take care, my legion. And stay tuned. Hopefully stay tuned for some more unusual stuff. All right. Thank you, everybody. Bye.